Looking at this horse here, he got an intramuscular injection of Butte which should never go in the muscle. And unfortunately, uh, this guy got an abscess in the muscle due to that. Um, it was responding fairly well to topical treatments initially, but it's starting to swell back up on us. So we're gonna get a little bit more aggressive, go in there, drain it, get a sample of the fluid, see exactly what's going on in there. It smells good. So it's really just a seroma. So just some, some fluid that's collecting in that area, which is a good sign. We'll take a little sample here and culture it just to make sure nothing nasty is growing in there. A kennel log and a time cell log. That's the fluid that's coming out? That's the fluid that's coming out, yeah. So you see it's cloudy, which means it's cellular, so there's probably a lot of white blood cells in there. It's a little bit brown, which means there's some component of some red blood cells that have been uh, degraded, kind of breaking down in there. So it's a, it's a combination of a seroma and a hematoma potentially with a little bit of infection going on there, but there's no frank pus, which is a good thing. 